Shira from 4th D Presidency Public School, Shira. First of all, I am going to wish you all Happy National Science Day. Science, isn't it about why? It's about why not? Yes, why not we talk about Science Day? Yes, 28th February is celebrated as National Science Day. And 10th November is celebrated as World Science Day for Peace and Development. In India, 28th February is celebrated as National Science Day. On this day in 1928, Sir Chandrasekhar Venkatraman discovered the phenomenon of scattering of photons named Raman effect after his name. After two years, in 1930, he, dis he got a Nobel Prize and he it was a first Nobel Prize in India in the field of science. And to mark this phenomenal discovery, National Science Day is celebrated on the day each year. And now I am going to do some small experiment. Uh, let's start. Now I am going to do an experiment on atmospheric pressure. Um, I am fourth standard, no. In my book it is, this chapter is there. So I am doing this. Let's start. For this experiment we need a candle, a glass, a glass of water and some glasses. Okay, and a tray. First, I'll pour some water. I'm putting a candle upon it. And I'm going to light it. Now I am placing the glass upon it and I am going to press it. The pressure is going. Can you listen the voice? Yes. This is the pressure. The oxygen in the cup is vacuuming. Huh. See how it is struck to it. And I keep two glasses and I am going to pour water. Yes. And I am going to lift it. The force is more. See, I can see the pressure, the flame in the uh, cup. The this is the way how atmospheric pressure, uh, when the flame uses the oxygen in the cup, that time what has happens means low, its pressure will be become low, and atmospheric pressure then tries to force the way in the tissue. Namaste everybody, my name is Kushias. I am studying in 4C. Today I am going to explain the multiple uses of solar energy by using solar energy kit. Solar energy means the energy of the sun. Each and every day, earth receives a huge amount of solar energy. By using scientific methods, we can utilize solar energy by converting into useful forms of energy through the use of semiconductor device like silicon known as photovoltaic cell or solar cell produces voltage. A single solar cell produces small amount of voltage. For high voltage, large number of cells are connected in form of series forming solar panel. Electrical energy can be stored in nickel cadmium batteries by connecting them to solar panel. By connecting them to solar panel.
panel. Now, nickel cadmium batteries, solar energy stored in nickel cadmium batteries. We can convert it into light energy. Electrical energy. Sound energy. Electromechanical energy. All the solar cells are expensive but it uses for a long time and have a low running cost. Solar energy is used in industrial zones for power generations. Nowadays, developed countries produce cars that are completely running solar energy. Solar energy is a renewable source which we can use again and again. Solar energy does not pollute our environment because it does not produce carbon dioxide and sulfur dioxide. Pagodas Solar Park is the world's second largest photovoltaic solar park. Thank you. I am going to show my project. This is my science project. And here I have made one... Um, home means house. Here I have made so many trees. Here I have written collecting rain waters. Here I will collect rain waters and it, here it will filter water. It will filter water and here it is well. Um, it will filter after after filtering it will come to well. So all my friends will take it and uh, we will use for our daily use and uh, now i will say what uh, what what i have made like that one house plants and trees one street light and uh, car parking stones and uh, fire camp that's all so thank you Namaste everyone. Good morning respected principal, teachers and all my dear friends. My name is Sakshi and I am studying in 4th standard A section. Now I am going to... Now I am standing in front of you to talk about our human digestive system. Let us talk about that. Mouth. The digestion process is started in the mouth. And the food is chewed well inside the mouth. Food pipe or esophagus. Inside the food from the mouth passes to the stomach by the food pipe. Inside the stomach, the food is broken down into further smaller pieces by kernel. Liver and pancreases are used to produce the digestive juices. The green part inside the liver, near the liver, is called gallbladder. A small intestine. Inside the small intestine, the Digestive process is completed and it absorbs the food and nutrients from our body. Large intestine. Inside the large intestine, the water, part, water particles are absorbed and the large intestine produces facies. Rectum. Inside the rectum, the facies are stored for a short time. Anus. From the anus, the facies are removed completely from our body. Thank you everyone for giving me an opportunity to participate in this competition. Once again, thank you everyone. Now I am Sarvi S.Y. studying in 4B, the Presidency Public School. Today I am going to explain the excretory system. The excretory system helps to remove waste from our body and the process of removing the waste from our body is called excretion. The, this excretory system mainly contains four parts, a pair of kidney, a pair of ureters and a 
urinary bladder and the urethra. The urine is formed in kidneys and the former urine is passed to urinary bladder through the thin pipes called ureters. And the passed urine is stored in the urinary bladder. This stored urine is released from our body through the urethra. This is how the excretory system works in our body. And, it's, and it helps to remove the waste from our body. Thank you. My name is Rachana C. I am studying in 4th standard A section. Today I am going to explain about rain, or, rain water harvesting. Now this is, this is the cloud. You imagine that now the rain is falling. And now from this pipe it goes through go to this water tank and from this water tank it goes here and you it it is helped it is helped to the domestic animals and to drink water and for flowers also this is known as rainwater harvesting and also if you follow this method in the rain rainy season it uh, the wastage of water will be required in the rainy season and in the summer season we will be having more of water like this. So please save the water. Thank you. Namaste everyone. My name is Dilal Todar and today I am going to make a science experiment. Materials needed for science experiments are box of matchsticks nail polish and a cup of water. Now, let me start. I'm taking nail polish and putting it into the jar of water. Now, I'm going to light it up with matchsticks. is oxygen and fuel are needed to burn things. Thank you one and all. On this great day, I like to dom demonstrate the experiment. It expands on being heated. See, now I have taken a hot water in a bowl and I have taken a and I tie a balloon. Now I am keep. Now I am keeping the empty bottle in a hot water. Observe carefully what happens. What happened? The balloon is blowing. By seeing this, we can tell it expands on being heated. Thank you. Now, I am going to demonstrate how a string will freezes on the ice cube when salt is put on it. First, take Two ice cubes. Put some salt on it. Place the string and also another ice cube on it. After some after some time, we will see that the string will freezes on the ice cube. This is because when 
salt is added, the freezing point of water is lower. Hence, ice melts by absorbing heat from adjacent particles. So, uh, so uh, around uh, the area around it cools and freezes those water particles to ice ice and along with the string. Hence, ice for, uh, the string got frozen to the ice and also we can lift by the string. We can lift the ice cube by the string. We should wait for another 5 times. Another 5 minutes. We can lift the ice using the string. This effect can be seen by adding sugar or any other substance because this substance also lowered the freezing point of water. Once again I will show it. Thank you. Namaste all of you. I am Dheeraj Goda from 4th Select Dhika Shira. My topic is on science project word. Bubble inside the bubble. I took a glass of water and the shop and sugar. I mix three. I am putting on the table this water. Bubble form because of water required surface tension due to the soap. Hydrogen atmos in a water molecule are attached to oxygen atmos in other water molecule. They like each and they cling together. Thank you.